effort to prevent underage drinking. They also say it's an effort to bring consistency to those who are asked to show their ID. Also today, Governor Herbert will be working with the Children's Center to review the state's mental health resources for children in Utah's first summit on children's mental health. Health experts will be looking at geographic areas that have the greatest need and the reach of those resources and programs that are currently in place to help. They'll also look at the benefits of early intervention. Experts say they hope to help the governor shape the path forward for meeting the needs here in Utah. Well, today is National Child Health Day. It's time to focus specifically on the things that your children need to lead a happy and a healthy life. Simple steps. Uh, it's so important not to ignore regular well checks, too, because one in six children in the U.S. have either a mental, a developmental, or a behavioral health issue. As parents and professionals, if we miss those kids early, then we're missing a critical window to intervene. That's Dr. Ryan Gottfriedson, of course. He told me that uh, those visits can inform parents and doctors about the overall wellness of your child. Uh, make sure that their vaccines are up to date, get a 360 degree view of any potential health issues and help track their growth and development. The one thing that kind of helps make everything better is to really focus hard on proper nutrition and exercise and sleep for kids. All, it, you know, it's not like those things make everything all better, but it does make everything's somewhat better. Baby steps, right? And things uh, you can control and can't control. You can control these things. Uh, during the initial days of the pandemic, parents were really holding off on those basic doctor visits for children for fear of contracting coronavirus. But Dr. Godfordson told me, thankfully, there is a lot less fear now about just a basic doctor's visit. And it's absolutely necessary for your kids. He said at Utah Valley Pediatrics, where he works, they're getting those typical visits back uh, in full swing. So we want to help you stay healthy in Utah. So we're giving away a stay healthy prize pack every day this week and that includes hand sanitizer clorox wipes face masks extra goodies from the governor's office so head over to our ksl tv facebook page to enter just a friendly reminder for anyone to keep social distancing keep wearing your masks don't forget to get your flu shot either i know that's a top of mind this time of year as we head into flu season guys and grant as a parent one of the things that is concerning me right now